Resend versus SendGrid versus Node Mailer. Which mail API is better in 2025? So Resend is a modern email API built for developers who want a fast, reliable, and straightforward way to send transactional emails. So Resend, as of 2025, it's gained popularity for its developer-first approach, clean REST API, and tight integration with frameworks like Next.js and Vercel. So one stands out feature is its zero configuration setup, making it ideal for projects that needs to ship emails quickly without diving into complex settings. Now let's talk about SendGrid. SendGrid by Twilio remains one of the most comprehensive and widely used email platforms in 2025. It offers robust APIs for both transactional and marketing emails with deep analytics, A and B testing, automation workflow, and email listing management. So this biggest strength is scalability. Large enterprises trust SendGrid to send millions of emails with high deliverability. The dashboard is feature-rich but can feel overwhelming for beginners or teams that only need basic email functionality. Now, on the other hand, a node mailer is a node.js module that allows developers to send emails directly from their backend, and it's still a solid choice in 2025 for a low-level control and simplicity. It's completely free, open source, and doesn't require third-party services. You can configure it with SMTP servers like Gmail, Outlook, or even custom mail servers. So for the final thought, choose Resend if you want a clean, fast, developer-friendly experience focused on transactional email. Now you want to choose SendGrid if you need a full-featured, scalable solution with robust analytics and marketing capabilities. And lastly, you want to choose Node Mailer if you prefer open source simplicity and a full control over your email delivery setup. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one.